God has rescued us from the power of darkness. We see in 2 Corinthians chapter 1, God rescued Paul when he was suffering. Paul said, brothers and sisters, we want you to know about the hard times we had in Asia Minor. We were having a lot of trouble. It was far more than we could stand. We even thought we were going to die. In fact, we felt as if we were under a death sentence. But as a result, we stopped relying on ourselves and learned to rely only on God who raises the dead. And he did rescue us from mortal danger. And he will rescue us again. We have placed our confidence in him. And he will continue to rescue us. And you are helping us by praying for us. Then many people will give thanks because God has graciously answered so many prayers for our safety. God rescued Paul when he was suffering. And he will rescue you. All praise to God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. God is our merciful Father and the source of all comfort. He comforts us in all our troubles so that we can comfort others. When they are troubled, we will be able to give them the same comfort God has given us. For the more we suffer for Christ, the more God will shower us with his comfort through Christ. They stop relying on themselves and learn to rely only on God. We must stop relying on ourselves and learn to rely only on God. We must have faith in Him. We must be praying for ourselves, and we must be praying for one another. Paul said, you are helping us by praying for us. Then many people would give thanks because God has graciously answered so many prayers for our safety. God is our merciful Father, the source of all comfort. He comforts us in all our troubles so that we can comfort others. God has rescued us from the power of darkness and has brought us into the kingdom of his son, who he loves. His son paid the price to free us, which means that our sins are forgiven. When the devil tries to come against you, say to him, God has rescued me from the power of darkness and has brought me into the kingdom of his son, Jesus. Every test or temptation that you have experienced is the kind that normally comes to people. But God keeps his promise and he will not allow you to be tested beyond your power to remain firm. At that time, you are put to the test. He will give you the strength to endure it and provide you with a way out. Thank God he has already delivered us through Jesus Christ. Jesus said, we must always pray and never give up. I'm Pastor Larry Cobb of the Redeeming Light Ministries. You have a blessed day.